What is going on guys? Grave here. I'm sure most of you have heard the news that Season 1 for Black Ops Cold War has been delayed by a little bit. Uh, Treyarch today kind of came out, talked about why they're delaying, and also talked about some free things they're going to give out to the community for, you know, having patience with them, you know, while they get Season 1 content ready. Also, some talks of double XP. Before I get into all the details, make sure if you're not subscribed to take a second, click that subscribe button. If you are a subscriber, make sure you have notifications turned on. If you enjoy the video, I would appreciate it if you'd hit the like button. Also, check out everything down in the description, the community Discord, my Twitter, and of course, the affiliate GT Racing. Like I said, we are going to get a small delay with Season 1. Now, it's not like a massive delay, not like a month or anything like that, but Season 1 will be delayed until December the 16th. Treyarch announced there were some things they wanted to clean up, some improvements they wanted to make to the game, so they decided to go ahead and delay uh, the Season 1 content. That's also going to delay you know, Warzone coming into Black Ops Cold War until the 16th as well. But they said they will be adding a new patch update for Cold War on Tuesday, December the 8th. They said this will be available for all platforms. And of course, when that update comes out, I will make a video, you know, kind of talking about the patch notes and things like that. But they did say there's going to be a lot of, you know, information coming out between the 7th of December and the 16th of December. Kind of talking about all the stuff you can expect to see during Season 1. I mean, they've gone into detail about a massive amount of stuff coming to the game between Warzone and of core, uh, and of course, uh, core modes, you know, multiplayer, that kind of thing in Cold War. They also went ahead and pretty much revealed today, which we all knew, I talked about this in a video a few days ago, that Raid will be returning and it will be playable on day one of season one. So as soon as season one comes out, you will, you will be able to play Raid as a 6v6 map. It said also make room on your gunsmith table for free to acquire weapons and prepare for new zombie modes and season challenges. Uh, they said they understand that you know everybody's wanting a new wanting new content wanting the new season and to kind of show their appreciation for the continued support and patience of the community they will be unlocking double weapon xp and double uh double just regular xp starting december the 12th at 10 a.m pacific time and that will run until the launch of season one so we're going to get several several days there with double weapon xp and double xp also to show their appreciation they're giving away free uh, bundles. This is all you have to do is simply log in between 10 a.m. Pacific time on December the 8th and 11 p.m. Pacific time on December the 15th to claim both bundles. This is going to be the field research bundle and the certified bundle. The field research bundle has one epic operator skin, one epic SMG blueprint, one epic reticle, one epic calling card, and one rare weapon charm. The certified bundle is one uh, epic rare uh, operator skin again, of course, a rare assault rifle blueprint, an epic reticle, and one epic weapon charm. It says over the next week, expect additional communication, you know, you know, to the community. Uh, and of course, you know, you can go either on their Treyarch blog, social media, whatever the case may be. They're going to start telling a little bit more and more, like I said, about what you can expect for the next season or for season one and kind of what you can expect next for Call of Duty Warzone as it gets integrated into Black Ops Cold War. Anyway, guys, leave me a comment with your thoughts. Um, I, I know it's kind of disappointing to hear that Season 1 is getting delayed. I know a lot of us want more content. I've talked about the one big, big issue I have with this game is the lack of maps in 6v6. Even though the map I'm on right here in Crossroads, this small Crossroads map uh, for Team Deathmatch, Dom, Hardpoint, is probably one of my favorites. I really enjoy playing this. It's small, but not too small. A very enjoyable map, and hopefully... You know, with the addition of Raid, we might get some other remastered maps or maybe some good maps that, you know, that are new, fresh to the game uh, coming out with Season 1. I'm really looking forward to that. But like I said, it is kind of disappointing. But at the same time, we're going to get two free bundles and some double XP, which is pretty cool for them to do, uh, considering, you know, it's not getting delayed for a long period of time. It's just a couple days compared to what it was going to be. But leave me a comment, guys, with your thoughts. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.